Yes, and it was great news that emerged over the weekend that Workforce, the Derby and Art winner, has been given the green light by Connections to go for the Breeders' Cup turf. Lord Teddy Grimthorpe, Racing Manager to Prince Card Abdullah, is on the line now. Uh, Teddy, what was it that impressed you so much about his work at the weekend which encouraged you to go for it? Um, well, it wasn't just that. It, it was his whole, the way he's been after the arc, um, the way he's the way he's gone, his, his general demeanour, and obviously his work's been an important part of that as well. And um, he showed us uh, on Saturday that he was in very good form, um, both, you know, physically and mentally. And um, so uh, the Prince was happy to give the go-ahead. And you've made, you made a point already in the press saying that the, as long as the ground is OK, I mean, if, if the ground was to contain the word, you know, firm or fast in it, would you be having reservations? Um, I think we'd have to sort of obviously play that one uh, as, as we see it. But I gather, I, I gather there's been a sort of new strip or a fairly new strip laid and they've hardly used it. Yeah. Um, the turf track there, so it will be a pretty good track, I would imagine. So I'm not anticipating a problem there. Yeah, I don't think it's been used for about three months, in fact, has it? So, which is good news. But of course, we all wondered, didn't we, that after the derby, maybe the the, the fact that he had that hard race at Epsom uh, caused him to to go back in the in the King George. But clearly, the, this hasn't happened after his victory in the Ark. I don't think so. I mean, I have to say we were happy with him going going into the King George as well. So, it was, you know, and the, the shock on everybody's face, on our faces in particular, was, was, was obvious to see. So, um, uh, you, you know, but we've... Ooh, the whole, uh, every, all, you know, so far the signs have been, uh, have been very, very good with him. And there's been, never been any doubt that midday is obviously heading straight to the Breeders' Cup filly and mare to defend her title there. And that seems to be, touch wood, a, a fairly straightforward preparation. Yeah, she's, she, everything has, dare I say, has gone, gone, gone really well for her. Um, she came out of the Vermeer good nick, um, started up again um, and sort of worked her old familiar self, really, which is really exciting. And they obviously spearhead Prince Khalid's uh, challenge for the Breeders' Cup. But is Proviso being lined up for a, a one out there too? Yeah, Proviso goes to the mile. Yeah. Oh, does she? Takes on Goldie Cover. Yeah. Very exciting. And, um, and back home on the domestic level, you must be delighted that you're, you're heading off to, or Prince Khalid Abdullah is heading off to his, his first owner's championship for seven years. Yeah, I know. It's, it's, been, it's been an exceptional season in, in every way, really. We couldn't... You know, we could hardly have hoped for for a year like when you know to have the likes of sort of workforce, Frankel, midday. Really, it's been it's been tremendous, and that's not forgetting sort of twice over and uh, and uh, by word. You know, it's been it's been really fantastic. Yes, and twice over uh, taking his race in the Champion Stakes, all right. Yeah, he came out kicking him back. You know, he was bouncing the other day. So he's yeah, he's 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 a remarkable horse, really. And what's happening to Frankel now, Teddy? Now that his his campaign is at an end, what what what's he what's he doing right well, now? Well, he just he he just be sort of be taking over in in, in the winter now, you know. Finally, uh, sorry, yeah, I was going to yeah, sorry, go ahead, yeah, yeah, no, so ticking over in the winter, and and would the idea be to come back and aim him for a, a trial race before the Guineas next um, spring? Um, I, I I think that would be up to Henry. I, I think, I mean. Uh, uh, I've sort of spoken to him a couple of times, but really, it's, there's not. There's, there's, I, I would imagine he quite like. He generally likes to give his horse a trial um, before these sort of races. So, yeah. um, you know, then that, that rarely leads to any possible two. You know, either the Greenham or the or the Craven. So, um, I, I think you know that that would be dependent on the horse and how he how he's been.